to my YouTube channel and I know what you are thinking. You're thinking, wow, she's actually sticking to her word and posting on a Saturday for the second week in a row. Um, I'm getting used to posting regularly because I want to do a Vlogmas, as I said in the last video. And I've got a really exciting uh, Christmas intro and outro made by someone on Instagram who I will include in the description. So this video is going to be a kind of half pony pamper type thing. Um, I've ordered something from Smart Grooming which I've wanted for ages to help me keep tame this, this mane here. And it's not come yet, uh, but I will probably unbox that later in the video. Um, but I just wanted to clean his mane and tail just in preparation for it because he is overdue for a big clean. So I'm just preparing a bucket because in winter we always have a warm bucket of water. We don't actually have a hot whole shower, whatever you call it, so we just boil the kettle, which has just finished boiling, and add some cold water to it. So it's I just turn the cold tap on and I let that run for a bit. So it is now a lukewarm bucket of water and because I'm only washing his mane and tail, I'm going to leave it without soap in. Uh, I've got my sponge, which is just like a dish dishwasher sponge because they're cheaper. You can get like 10 for a pound, so. Saving money. Let's pop that in. So the first thing I'm gonna do is just brush all of his mane, just as you would every day anyway. Um, needs a bit of care. So as you can see now, actually, his mane is very long at the minute. He's not been doing much competing this year. Um, so I haven't really done much with it, but I thought I'd treat myself and him to a nice new mane. So now I've brushed his mane through, I'm just going to take the sponge and I'm going to just wet all of his mane. Bye. 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 So now I've kind of wet his mane all the way down, I've just picked up the shampoo. I'm not going to use overly amount, I'm not going to use a lot, um, just because he doesn't need a lot, I just want it all like the grime and dirt out from the field. Uh, I went through earlier that it is the apple, uh, an apple scented hair shampoo that you can use on yourself. Just a bit more broken and dirty that you would use it on yourself. <laughs> so I'm just going to trickle a little bit on. And then I'm going to rub it in with my hands. <laughs> some of the flaky old skin in there will come out you can go see it in this section where he scratches the most it's coming out um so yeah so now i can get my sponge back
out all the shampoo that was in there. I've been around and I've been and checked it for shampoo, so there's no shampoo left, and I've just grabbed my sweat scraper just to get rid of any of the water that's kind of gone in place. Oh, you see, gone in places other than his mane. So that's his mane done. I'll come back to it after I've done his tail. So I'm just going to do his tail now, and I'm going to brush it first. <laughs> He's used to the way that I wash his tail, um, and he doesn't mind how I wash his tail. But some people, I wouldn't recommend this if your horse is quite jumpy. But I literally dunk his tail in the bucket and hold the bucket up as high as I can. So we've just been and got his very rather empty looking mane and tail spray. He has the Cande Martin one, just because that's the one that I bought. <laughs> uh, so I'll just spray this in his tail. rather grubby looking blue tail so I've left his mane to dry for a little bit and now I'm going to spray it for a very little amount of this on it just at the top ends because that's where he gets the most the most tangled knotty and then I'll just brush it through I'm going to leave that a bit longer to dry uh, before moving them back up. So, I'm on my way to the post office to see if it's arrived. Um, I don't want to speak very loudly because I think everyone like if anyone sees me walking and talking, they think I'm a bit of an idiot. I don't even know if you can hear me, but I'm on the way to post office to see if there. It's here. So it has arrived in these like smart grooming. I love the fact that it's got its own little tape. I can't show you this side because it kind of reveals my address and I don't want to show you it. But I thought I'd do a little um opening of it just because it's fun so you're now going to see me struggle to open an envelope I think I'll just see my dress on my business struggle me watch me struggle to open this envelope which I could have opened from the other side easier but you know me oh my god I'm so excited <laughs> oh my god now nah, this this is the way to my heart Haribos. Sweets on the way to my heart. Oh my god, that is so sweet. Oh my god, sweets. I love smart grooming. Smart grooming is funny. Is is like smart grooming has gone up in my rankings. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. The envelope is so cute. I love them. I love bubble wrapped envelopes so much. It comes with your royal information stuff. Um also it's come here. 
and you get a little card then it says thanks so much for your order we hope you enjoy our products and look forward to seeing the results to be featured on socials please be sure to mention or tag us instagram and twitter at smart underscore grooming and facebook at smart grooming definitely go and check them out i have wanted to order from these for such a long time and definitely will be ordering again just because i have seen the results from people i know who have this stuff and it makes ponies so white and as we all know blue likes to be dirty so then you've obviously got your little receipt which i'm not going to show on camera because it's got my dress on and we don't want that we don't want you all knowing where i live do we so what i bought is um smart tails yellow handle um like to make him smart and cute and um, i bought it in the your horse live discount so Got it a bit cheaper. I've wanted one of these for such a long time. It is absolutely mad. Um, and oh my god, I'm so happy. I've wanted one of these. So here's the actual thing. So it's got a little yellow handle and as usual, gorgeous packaging. I've seen some stuff like this in shops, but I've never really bought any because I always definitely knew I wanted the smart grooming one in particular just because I love smart grooming. I've been following it for such a long time. I'm really excited, so I'll just open it for you all to see. I'm not very good at opening packaging. Um, I love it so much. So who is, I'll add a little quiz for it in a minute. So yeah, I'm gonna do a little photo shoot with this in a minute. I am so happy. I love it. Show me over a bit. So I'm here with Blue and ready to start using our smart grooming tool, which I'm really excited to see the results. So first thing we do is brush all his on this side and we'll go from there. All his mane is now brushed onto this side. So I'm gonna start with our little tool brushing through and see what we can do. do a little close-up of how well it works. I'm almost finished filming it out. It's done a really good job but I just want to show you actually how it works on just this one little bit I haven't done. So you just literally pull it through like that and then look, it all comes out. And so I'm just thinking I've finished all the filling out I'm gonna do with it and the next step is to just pop it over the other side and get some scissors maybe just to trim up the edges which is what I'm gonna do personally just trim it up and finish it and then we'll move on to the tail so this is the finished product it is quite short but and I have really thinned it out just so I could see where he has actually been scratching the most which is resulting in this section here which was hidden and I didn't know he was scratching there which means I need to do a bit more there and then we knew here anyway so that's all right so I just need to put a bit more in here when I sort him out but I'm really proud of him and I really like it so I'll do his tail next so I've just brushed his tail through and we're started on the tail now probably a bit of a different angle than this one you want my mum to film from behind she is so yeah i ever find the right words and there's no way this is real life there's no telling you're the right girl so i can only say that it feels right it feels right it feels right yeah i can only say that it feels right it feels right it feels right yeah i can only say that it feels right so this is the finished tail i'm actually really proud with how well it looks here it looks actually quite nice and proper and definitely has also highlighted to me where he scratches which is what I kind of need to know so I know where to treat it and yeah it's really highlighted to me how much he scratches because on his mane when I was doing it it was like you couldn't see um where he was scratching because he was he scratches the other side of his neck and you couldn't see it and it looked 
like it looks really thick from the side but I left it just in case and I was right to leave it because when I turned it back over the other side it was really quite thin because where he scratched it out at the ends makes it look a lot thinner because he his roots are growing through so I think his mane looks really good and will look amazing once the layers have all grown back from when he because he scratched them out and I actually think his tail looks really really nice so yeah so I'm gonna end my so I'm gonna end this video there guys I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did please leave a like comment and maybe subscribe um that'd be nice uh and I hope to see you next week. Stop being antisocial. I hope to see you next week for another video. Bye. Say bye. Come on. You are a good boy.